I heard that there's a beautiful young lady in here. Good to see you, sweetie. <laughs> Erin and Brandon are really two of the heroes in this movement, you know, with their daughter, Michaela, seven years old. I mean, she's surviving cancer using the soil. And, you know, you really have to give props to the people that have the courage and the strength and, you know, the confidence to step up and, and you know, change the way people think about what we're doing. I agree that, and as a matter of fact, I've written several op-ed pieces that have been published in the local paper. Right, and I, so what I'd like to encourage you guys to have a healthy debate on the show. Just don't, don't, don't turn yourselves down. It's television. People want to hear both sides. They want it to be clear. And then come to this point at the end where it's like, you're collegial, you're old friends, you both kind of are working toward the same goal, which is regulation, standards and practices, treating this like the potent drug that it is. So the way we're going to start is Ricky will do a little bit of an introduction and then we're going to say Erin and her boyfriend Brandon have recently made national headlines with their controversial decision to administer marijuana to their seven-year-old daughter Michaela who was diagnosed last summer with an aggressive form of cancer known as T-cell leukemia. Then we're going to watch a news package. Yeah. I'm Brandon Crimson. Then we're going to come back. Joining us now is Brandon. And then she's going to say to you, Aaron, take us back to the day Michaela was diagnosed. Your family yeah, picture exactly. is ready to be pulled up, so anytime you're talking about it or breaking it, our stage manager will be listening and our director will be listening, and they'll have those gorgeous pictures of her that we have. Because I think. She actually went a month without treatment. Actually, she had a break from it. There's an antibiotic that caused her some problems, and she had to move out of state. She had a month without treatment. Actually, had a break from it. There's an antibiotic that caused her some problems, and she had a month off of chemo, and she didn't even relapse. Sweet potatoes and apples.